expensive time It's why conscience is done to the core Just another day, just another What we're looking at is a uh, uh, Musion Eyeliner 3D screen and uh, how it works, it's a uh, Pepper's Ghost technology from the 1800s. It's a simple technology, but uh, how it's utilized here is it's a, a Mylar film at a 45 degree angle uh, utilizing high definition signals uh, processed by Christie projectors. And uh, a high definition signal, high resolution signals coming into the projectors project onto a screen, a bounce screen if you will, a reflective screen. Uh, reflects up into the Mylar film and creates a vertical holographic looking image. While it's not 3D and it's not holographic, it gives you a, a perspective or illusion of that and uh, creates imagery without having to wear 3D glasses or uh, any special equipment. Well, on stage behind us right now, we have a, um, a live feed uh, via telepresence. So uh, a Masergy has brought in a uh, 18 megabit line into the building for us and uh, utilizing a high vision codec, uh, we're bringing it in at low latency at, uh, at less than 70 milliseconds of latency so that we can bring somebody lifelike with no delay as a uh, high definition, high quality image that uh, utilizing this system, they'll appear as they're standing on stage real. And uh, when you bring somebody on stage with them, as you can see behind us, one person's real, one person's a holographic image, and they appear to be on stage together. We've had a long history of working with Christie and Vista in particular, and uh, they're a fantastic company to work with. They help us understand uh, how we can utilize the equipment. We. Uh, and they listen to us more than uh, more than anything. They're a company that comes to us and asks us for input, and uh, they take what we do out in the real world and implement it into their products. We have uh, two uh, Christie uh, HD 18s in here, uh, converged, and uh, we're using the uh, the warping engines in those as well. So we're. We're shooting straight down, well, not straight down, but a little bit of an angle down and uh, converging those projectors and lens shifting all the way out so that we can get uh, the imagery flat on the ground. And then we use the warping engines just to bring those two exactly uh, on top of each other. We have telepresence feeds coming in from London, Montreal, Dallas. And uh, with those feeds, we, we're utilizing spider to uh, size, to uh, using the layers and the spiders to bring different inputs into the system. And um, yeah, the Vista system gives us the ability to put uh, live people on stage, um, uh, telepresence, uh, holographic images coming in as telepresence on stage, insert graphics, and all of those elements combined to make a uh, a lifelike experience as if they're all at the same place at the same time. We have a URS system in here as well. We have multiple inputs coming in. We have all the different screens and uh, the lower monitors, the upper monitors as well for graphical treatment that we're utilizing that for. So we have quite a few different feeds from it. And uh, how we use the system also is we have another Christie projector backstage shooting up at another reflective screen. And the reflective screen in the ceiling creates a uh, holographic image for the presenter. So while the audience is watching a holographic projection from the front with the content, the person on stage is actually watching a holographic image of either a teleprompter or a confidence monitor on the back side of the film that the audience can't see. So if I ever saw you, I did.